my favorite part about Utah is the unique combination of technology, people, and also patients. With Utah being a major referral center for the Rocky Mountain area, we see a lot of interesting cases that some other places don't see as many of, including TBIs, because we have a lot of transplants done here at the university. We see a lot of total skin electrons, which aren't seen at a lot of programs. I mean, there's a lot of technology, both that was present while I was um, interviewing and, and looking at coming here, but then uh, things that we've implemented. We've really established ourselves as a leader in the surface imaging realm. Our radiation oncology department is growing fast. In the past five years, we replaced the two treatment walls with variant true beams and added another two variant true beams at satellite clinics. The new Proton Center will start to treat patients in the early 2021. My physics mentor for the treatment planning rotation that I'm currently in is Frances, and she is great. Um, she knows so much, and she's always willing to share what she knows with me and walk through things with me uh, from the physics side. And then with the dosimetry side, I learn how to plan those treatments and how best to you know set up the fields. We have enough faculty have a, a large breadth of knowledge, but not so big that people kind of get lost in the mix. It's a tight-knit group of physicists. We have a really good relationship with our, our physician colleagues. People are always looking at helping other people solve problems. I'm not as outdoorsy as I think a lot of people in the department are, but I still love Salt Lake City, even though there is a lot of outdoorsy stuff to do. It's not so big of a city that you get lost in the shuffle, but it's the perfect size to have lots of things to do. And a lot of places have outdoor opportunities, but our hospital is built into the mountain. You can't get much closer to the outdoors. I mean, there's, there's hiking trails behind the hospital. It's literally at your doorstep.